Hi friends, welcome to free automation learning channel and my name is Chirag. Today we are going to discuss about how how we can pass parameters through testng xml file. So we can pass our parameters through testng xml file into our test cases. So we will look into this and we will create testng xml file which has a parameter. I just I'm just I am going to show you how we can pass parameters through our testng xml files to test cases and what is the advantage of these parameters so basically we can pass parameters through testng.xml file so the concept behind is like that suppose i need to run our test script through ie or i wanna to run my test script on firefox so I just open this testng.xml file and pass there Firefox. I will not go to change my code where I have to pass uh, Firefox to run the my test script on Firefox or Chrome. I just open testng.xml file and pass there. So this would be that non-technical person can do because we are not going to into a deep code we are just go to a xml file so this would be the advantage of testng.xml file uh, by passing parameters right and there would be a one more annotation that is a optional so we will use this optional annotation or tag with the parameters right so let me open my eclipse this is my eclipse and here as i in previous video i created this test suits and testng.xml file so we will use this testng.xml file but i am going to create a new class for tutorial 10 and generate commands so here I would like to that this class is for parameters through test ng xml file right so let me first uh, i will copy my uh, code from my previous video let me copy this code from this yes this i am going to copy this code why i am co copying because i just do not want to write this code again i have to explain parameters so i will focus on parameters right so what would be this code this code i have uh, copied from my tutorial 5 and this is the before method we just invoke firefox and this is about a uh, search we are searching let me change the method name search keyword here we are searching our keyword in google and after that we quit the driver so here i just need to pass a parameter right i need to pass parameter here a string para so here i will pass para but i'm going to do i will pass this para from testng.xml file right i am not a want to hard code it i want to pass it from testng.xml file so how can i do how can i do i will i am going to show you this so here i will write parameters okay and 
and I'm pass keyword over here this right so this is about the parameters this annotation shows that this test case has a parameters which could be passed from testng.xml file which is this right so here I am going to pass parameter and here we need to give the name so my parameter name would be keyword so I just go and copy and what I am going to search I have to search anything maybe APM right and let me replace this as I need to use this tutorial 10 so I would write tutorial 10 and this is ok so what it will do it will invoke and pass the parameter what we have passed and then it passed APM and it searched by APM right so let me run this by test suit. so you can see Firefox is going to launch soon yes Firefox has launched it will load and you can see APM has been successfully searched right so what I did and if you can see that one test case is passed right so what I did I just pass APM through this test ng.xml file and after that it passes from here and it runs successfully right so suppose uh, I want to run my test and uh, test cases through this right click from simple test ng test not a suit so let me run this and you can see that a uh, exception occurred and it is saying that parameter keyword is required right so what it, it means that the it has a parameter which is required so at that point we are not able to run this by right click or through test ng test if i run from test ng suit then it will run right so how we can handle that we have to use one more annotation that is optional annotation and in this i have to pass my keyword which I need to which I need to uh, pass or search by default so my test would run in that way if we run from this test ng.xml file right then it will search apm if I will execute through test ng dot test right at that time it will search selenium 3 so let me run this and we will verify what will be the result so so my firefox will launch and it navigate to google.com and you can see selenium 3 has been searched successfully so this is all about that at the rate optional tag right so basically this this uh, is the optional tag is used when we do not have any uh, parameter through uh, uh, which is defined by testng.xml file right if we run this testng.xml file then it will search apm so guys this is all about how we can use parameter and how we can pass parameter through testng x uh, from through test and dot x one five hopefully you understand this and if you like this video please press like button and if you have any suggestion suggestion please 
कमेंट मी और मेल मी थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो बाय बाय